My name is Jacob George, and I'm a three-tour vet of the Afghan War uh, turned peace activist. Uh, I've spent about two and a half years on the road now, riding my bicycle around the country, talking about my experiences at war uh, and seeking healing. In this society, there is an alarming lack of vulnerability among men and ways that we can share our pain with each other and our feelings. And I noticed from the very beginning of when these men started to gather, the space to be vulnerable was there. And that's not something you find in a lot of places. It, it shouldn't be like that, but that's how it is. So it, I was very struck by that space and by feeling like it was okay to share my feelings and to embrace other men and share their feelings as well. The medicine here, I have to say, is really strong. <laughs> I, you know, like I said, I've been riding my bicycle around the country for two and a half years, uh, specifically seeking healing and places of healing and methods of healing that work. Uh, and some of the things I was introduced to through this conference uh, are very unique, things I haven't come across yet, things I'm definitely going to take back into my work and I'm going to continue to seek out. And that's very powerful for me because you know, I work with a very a small group of veterans, not big, but we all try to go out in our communities. And we have committed to working on ourselves and trying to heal ourselves. And then what works, we bring back to our small little group and we share with each other. And we can all pass these tools on to a larger group of veterans. And I definitely picked up tools here that I can bring back to my veterans, sisters and brothers that can help us on this path. I've done other programs this year that focused on men's work. And I tried one that focused specifically on veterans. But one of the uniquely powerful things about this program is that it integrates civilian and veterans and the healing process. And people who haven't served honor us as warriors and listen to our stories and almost as if they're building a container around us so we can do this and they will more than willingly take what comes out of us uh, and hold that for us and I think it's very powerful for both sides of the coin to be involved in this healing process and not just one or the other and that integration is something that we definitely need to bring into our work as veterans. It's too easy to get caught up in just doing this with other veterans and not letting other people receive the healing or help us heal in the process.